Good morning. So it is Friday. Oh, thank God. If you if you hear it in my voice, I'm sick. I called out yesterday. I should have called out today. I feel worse today than yesterday. And every time I have to call out, I always feel like, what if tomorrow I feel worse? Maybe I should call out tomorrow. But I did it yesterday. And I got rest. I slept a lot. But I don't know. Something is out there. Something is out there. My allergies, my asthma, everything has been out of whack. So <clears throat> today I was going to call out, but I was like, no, you know, I don't want to waste my days. I need them. But yeah, if you hear me wheezing and you hear me huffing and puffing, we fine. We fine. It's fine. If you're new here, my name is Jackie and I love to do hauls, hauls, hauls. Some makeup looks, some fashion info, some home decor, some car vlogs. Not as much home decor, but if that's something you'd be interested in, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button. Join the fam. Everybody else, thank you so, so much for coming back. So, it is 7.40. I don't have to be at work till 8.50. So, I got about an hour. I want to go to Walmart because... Walk and talk, Jack. Walk and talk. Con Dios y la Virgen. Um... There's a couple of haul videos that I've been watching. You guys know that I was talking about that Merlot Burgundy kind of blazer that I had seen in Walmart. They got a crop version. I had tried on the crop version, didn't care for it. It was nice, don't get me wrong, it was nice, but it wasn't really what I was looking for. Ain't nobody on the road. So I was like, I don't want to buy it just for the color. I showed you guys. I picked up the Shein um, blazer jacket, which I ironed it very carefully, and I love it. I could have wore it today, but it's not going to be that hot today. Today, it's already 70, and it's like muggy and like humid. Like you could feel the thickness in the air. So I didn't want to, you know. I don't want to wear it today. But. Oh, I forgot to fill my outfit of the day. So I've been doing my OOTD for the week. I'm wearing this like peachy dress shirt. It's very soft and silky with some jeans. The jeans that I actually picked up from Aldi's that I was telling you guys. And then just some like moccasin um, nude sh um, slides. Not slides, like shoes, slip-ons. Um, but the reason I want to go to Walmart is because I have been seeing people hauling this cognac color trench coat. And it looks so soft and buttery that I was like, ooh. And you know me. I'm not a brown girl, but cognac I could do. Um, I prefer black, but sometimes when you buy full leather, black can look very cheap because it's very shiny for some reason and very like, you know, cheapy looking, but the cognac color looks so nice. So, I just want to see if they got it in the store. I think it's from Sofia Belgara. Um, and she does amazing clothes for Walmart. Scoop does too. I find Scoop a little pricey. I probably just cheap. But, yeah. So, I think it is from Sofia Belgara. If not, it's Scoop. But, I just want to see. Man, this ain't nobody here. Ain't nobody here. Well, until we get to the Walmart section, because the plaza is empty. You know, the TJ Maxx, the Home Goods, all of this is empty. But you get to the Walmart, and you know these moms and their kids that come food shopping early in the morning. Um, you know what? I'm so excited. 
I'm so excited. I don't even know when it's coming. But there was a Christmas tree shop that closed here in Danbury by the mall. A huge location. And if you've been to Christmas tree shop, you know they've got some beautiful stuff for the home. Come Christmas time, Thanksgiving time, any kind of time that you want to decorate. So nice. But oh, they closed down. And they just announced that Hobby Lobby is coming to town. I think there's a Hobby Lobby a couple of exits up going towards like Hartford, I think. Oh man, there's nobody in Walmart. Let me find a spot. Very, very close. Like right here. So I was so excited to hear that Hobby Lobby was coming. I don't know when they're coming. It's probably sometime next year. But I'm so excited. I wish Ross would come here. And I wish... Um, there's another place that you guys are always talking about. Ross. Hobby Lobby. Something else. Anyways, let's go see if we find this jacket.
they got these cute little like barrel bags they're how much are they oh 19.99 look at those They got like a tote style. This one is cute, but get this one. I feel like the coat is this material, like this color quilted like that. And they got the snake skin. So I didn't really find what I was looking for. I'm going to add the image of the trench that they didn't have. They had another brown one I showed you guys when we were walking around. It was like a, kind of like a button up. It was nice, but that's not what I was looking for. Then I went towards the clothes. They had a couple of things on clearance, like dresses and stuff. But not what I was looking for. So I didn't end up finding anything. I went towards the shoes and I, was, I had seen these they weren't in the store either so i think a lot of this stuff you have to buy online i did leave with something because you know they're kind of intimates i picked up this bikini um three pack of underwears they're super soft they're from joy spun i've picked up a bunch of their fluffy you know robes and i know that they're really nice i picked up pajamas but i've never tried their underwears but these seem very nice and soft so i got a pack of that that was two bucks two bucks let me show you my receipt two bucks and then i saw this bra and it's just like this it has no padding it has no nothing it's just like a mesh this was on clearance for five bucks and sometimes i wear tops and they're just a little bit like just a little bit and i always say you know i need something with less padding like my bras are t-shirt bras so they have like a little bit of padding so that you don't see any designs or nothing so i saw this and i was like I mean, I need it, but do I need it? Jack, just get a bigger size. So I was like, I'm going to just get it. It's five bucks. You can't go wrong. So I got it for five bucks. And then I saw this one. This one says five, but it's four dollars. And it looks like this. But you see this material? This is like that skims so smooth material. It is just like a little top um it's also from joy spun i feel like everything here is joy spun and i need something like this again i picked up a whole bunch of like the camis undershirts but again sometimes you don't want so many layers like if i put this under a v-neck cardigan like one of those chunky cardigans that's it you just need something right here that's it that's it so i was hoping to find like a nude color but this coffee color is nice and you just need a little bit of something so why not and sometimes when i get home i love to just get home and take off my bra like oh but sometimes you need something so i could throw something like this on just to have something or that you know or this one that it's just nothing under my pajamas so I was like yes girl yes and then I found this bra which is just another regular t-shirt bra but it was on clearance for $6.74 um, I don't know what the original price would be but this was $6.74 and again sometimes you just need another nude bra um, I love the fact that this has like this design here so even if i wear like a tank top and it's a little skinny skinnier spaghetti strap i feel like something like that looks nice because it looks kind of goldish so i got that i ended up spending 18.87 but i feel like these are pieces that you need you this is not always something you want to buy like you're always like i i need another bra that has the 
I don't want to spend twenty, thirty dollars on a bra just for that. But at two dollars, no, not two dollars, four dollars, you can't go wrong. So they didn't have any bags, so I'm walking out of there with the bras in my hands, and people are like, "You got that big ass bag? Why didn't you put it inside your bag?" But yeah, these are pieces that I needed, not exactly what I wanted. As you can see, because I'm playing the video of the walkthrough, they did have a lot of nice stuff. I love the fact that Sofia Belgara, Ashley Simpsons are coming out with these like big, wide, um, wide leg pants, kind of not bell bottoms, but just wide leg that you know. You know how everyone is saying the skinny jeans are out, skinny jeans are out. You need the skinny jeans for those high boots. So in those wide pants, you could wear your high boots. You know what I'm saying? But I wasn't in the mood to try nothing on. And a lot of the times I put the hanger next to me. And if you touch on the floor and you all the way up here, you're too long. So yeah, I don't know um, what I'm going to do. I'm heading to work now, actually. Welcome to work, Jack. Welcome to work. Um, when we go to lunch, we'll see. Because Marshalls, they don't open till 10. TJ Maxx don't open till 10. It's 8 o'clock in the morning, and I got to take out. So, we'll see what we do. But, these are the images of what I'm looking for. So I just left Burlington and I try to film a little bit inside but there was too many people. I was already getting funny looks so I was like yeah. I only bought one item. I didn't really see much in the plus size like extra large and then they jumped to 4x so I only got a shirt. I was going to go to TJ Maxx but I'm heading home because it is pouring. So I'll show you in a minute. Okay, so the only thing I ended up picking up was this top. Looks like this. It's like one of those bat wing types and it was $15.99. Um, I thought it'd be nice with like some work pants under a blazer it's not too heavy, so it's fine for like now. Um, so yeah, I didn't really find much, like I said, in a 1X or 2X, but <clears throat> I filmed a little, and then I ran into a family friend, and then I started talking to her, so I didn't really film, and then, you know, I was running out of time. So I was like, I have to go, I have to go. So she was like, I gotta go. By the time we went to check out, there was a huge line. And I was like, Ugh. And I was gonna just leave it. But I was like, no, I want this, I want this. And then next to the Burlington is a TJ Maxx. But I don't have time, because I got to go. Um, once my sister gets here, I gotta do a few things with her. And then I'm heading back up to Connecticut. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little store walk through they didn't really have much they do have a lot of coats not much in my size but if you're new here and you made it this far please consider hitting that subscribe button joining the fam everybody else thank you so so much for coming back and i will see you in the next one bye